A trash storm is coming. Up Weddy Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and Nerdigans they get today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Gashiyakuda chapter 46. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let us just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because of course this channel alone, this video are not sponsored if you love what we're doing and want to help keep me the adorable Zenokiti. And this channel live too, so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one. Feel free to hit up our cash app or PayPal. Links are in the description box below. So, so last time I covered this manga, and I covered a lot of chapters of this manga the last time I covered this manga, um, we, uh, we finished this stuff up with Amo, and I'm hoping Amo is still alive because I, I love her. She is my favorite female character up in here. Um, and, uh, well, we got to see a one-woman extermination show, which was pretty goddamn badass, let's be real. But, uh, something more going on. There is a storm coming, right, kitties? And I'm not talking about an adorable kitty storm. Well, because, like, the kitty Zeno is here, though. That's, that's a good, that's a different kind of storm, though. It's a cute storm. He's a kitty storm. Because he's a Zeno. Yeah, good Zenos. Good Zenos kids. Anyways, let's get to this chapter. See what's in store for us D uh, today. Before one's sight is the heavens. And then, woo! Oh, this color. This color is so beautiful. And there's the umbrella. Gratitude, inspiration, trash, hail! Woo! It's been a year? Oh my god, happy one year anniversary, Gachi Akuna. And by the way, something we did find out for sure is that uh, Rio and Rudo are the same height, which is very, I thought was interesting. But goddamn, this is the art I want! And look at the sky! I have to point this out with the sky. See how the sky is is polluted? This is what I want more of. Can I get more of this, please? And the art I live. Also, the graffiti. Oh, the graffiti looks good. This looks good. Rada, you are delivering. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. And also, of course, Yoshi. This, this is what I want more of. Give me more of this, please. More, more, more of this. Especially the grunt, because something I've been complaining about with um, the art is that it hasn't been giving me the grunginess that I've been looking for for a series like Gachi Akuda and not enough of the steampunk uh, element. And I find, like, in the color, I'm getting what I want, so I'm happy. I'm happy about this. So maybe when we get like a full colored edition, I'll get what I want. Oh God, please. I need a colored edition of this. Holy shit, I need a colored edition of this. But God, look at that sky. Oh my God, that sky makes me so happy. I love seeing the pollution in the sky here. It makes me happy. And the, oh God, it makes me happy. This makes me so happy. Oh, I see. Oh, is that? No. Oh, that is a Hamsa. Ah, oh, I get another Hamsa too. My culture! My culture! And Zonka looked like a bass! Yee! Look at my boy! I love Zonka so much. Alright, and this chapter is titled The Storm, um, Before the Storm, right? Yeah. My name is, well, it doesn't matter. I'm just a geezer that likes anything stylish. Um, I'm once again at the stylish shop, uh, Dundulce, where your usual tiredness is healed. Stylish food, stylish clerks, regular customers with stylish hair. Um, uh, there's new customers. Hmm, the space is really calming. If you exclude the fact that the cleaners are here, that is. <laughs> oh, he's, he's pissed. But man, Ron, this art looks great. Look at the veins. Yes. Arata, you are delivering. This art looks so good this week. Dude, I can't get over how gorgeous the color pages are. The color pages are giving me are giving me what I've been wanting for this entire manga. I'm so happy. I'm trying not to cry right now. Oh my god. Ah! Can I get more of that, please? Seriously. 
Exactly. They're regulars here, too. They're a group that makes the extermination of aberrant beasts into their livelihood, it seems. Givers, or should I say, people that depend on a single thing are somewhat creepy, though. Well, that's just how it is. Ugh, the look in that tattooed bastard's eyes is nasty. <laughs> Let's be real. Here's what normies would think of uh, people like, uh, like Enshin. That's spiritual, that is true. That's Rudos, that elk. They call Zonka an elegant looking bastard? That's my husband right there. He is an elegant looking bastard, let's be real. I love Zonka, that's my man. That's my husband right there. That elegant looking bastard also has a nasty look in his eyes. We're not even doing anything. You're just hating. Oh, you're right. Ooh, that look in that cute girl's eyes is nasty, too. You're straight up hating at this point. Because you're hating on my husbando, who you just said is elegant. And now you hate uh, Rio, who is, like, waifu. She's my second wife. Amo is, like, number one waifu, okay? she Well, oh, after that backstory, though, like, I feel like she's got to be best girl because of... Oh, I feel so bad for Amo because she's so damaged. I don't know. But you hate on Rio, too? Come on! You're just a hater. Rudo, sorry I messed up, uh, messed up a drink from your drink. Oh, oh, excessively nasty eyes. <laughs> Rudo is pissed. What's with this brat? He looks like he's about to pop a vein. So this is the fate of those who can who take on the aberrant beast. Damn, that's seriously terrifying. <laughs> I'll be back. Um, uh, thank you for coming. We got drink for my drink. You took a while. You took a while. Did you shit? <laughs> so, oh. I'm sorry. I have to admire this art. Arata, oh my god. I have been spoiled today. So, why do we, why do we always have an easygoing food being? Did we just get attacked? <laughs> You don't get it, do ya? For us, taking a breather isn't necessary. Yep, yep, we just finished a hard test. Wait, yep, yep, we just finished a hard test, so let us all have some grub together. Just shove and eat! <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, be a bit more edge on edge or something. You know what you mean, Rudolph, but... Dude, I love these backgrounds, too. Arata, you're giving me what I want! What I do deserve this! But you see, no matter how grim the situation is, as long as we, um, we're able to sit together and eat food, we can do our best at what comes next. Besides, this attack isn't the first to happen. There are countless people that want to kick down those who have it. Um, they're real sickening. Better off dead. Damn, man! It can't, it can't be that way every time there's an attack. Simi is the only one who drives them away? Yes. <laughs> Without a bizarre uh, method or ability, it'll be a little difficult to get past Simu. Dude, what a beast! She's a badass bitch! She can do- Dude! Oh my god, Simu's just like a badass bitch! Motherfucker! And also, I can't stand this, but I have to bring it up. Because I just- I've been seeing so much shit on it lately. Motherfuckers want to talk about diversity! It's like, dude! You want diversity in manga and anime? There's diversity in, in fucking Gachi Akuda. There's diversity in, like, Kenyan and freaking Hajime no Ippo. Like, are you motherfuckers just not reading any, uh, um, any series? I swear, mofos are so stupid. They just watch fucking Bao Shonen. They don't read. They, they just watch freaking dumbass anime. They watch, they watch mainstream anime. They don't they don't go beyond that, and it pisses me off. It's like, dude, you, you need to read more. Oh, yeah, Record of Ragnarok's another one, too. These people are so... These people frustrate me so much. You have no idea. Talking about diversity and not... Bitching about diversity and manga and anime not knowing that there are series that are diverse. Just don't fucking read. But anyways... But, well, even if a hypothetical break-in did happen, um, there'd be, there'd just be a, you did it, feeling of admiration. I get that. If she's that strong, why is she just the receptionist? Semyu's glasses, um, eyes have a seeing ability. It can't kill aberrants. 
She also seemed to admire, um, office ladies. Uh, that's most likely the first reason, huh? Yeah. <laughs> so that means, um, that just being a giver isn't enough to defeat Aaron's, huh? It differs, de um, depending on the giver's personality and the way of, uh, handling their jinky. Dude, just let, just let Semi just be the security system. She's the best fucking security system! If one wants to use their precious thing to its fullest, they're the offensive type. On the other hand, if one doesn't wish to cause harm and wants to safe keep their uh, keep, safe keep their precious thing, it's easy to become a defensive type. It sounds like gatekeeping to me. <laughs> sounds like all of us who are gatekeepers. Um, the values we give our precious things can bring out this much of a diff. Wait, the values we give our precious things can bring out this much of a difference. Wow, <laughs> I know. I want to see more givers. Oh. Oh, has your, wait, oh, oh, has your interest been aroused after all? Eh, don't worry, the guys that are coming right now are quite unique. The guys that are coming? Uh-oh. Made you wait, um, made you wait, bam, everybody! Team child meeting time! Good work, <laughs> yet. This kid's a uh, uh, quite a heavy fan of Fantasia Ty! I love, love his name! Quite a heavy Fantasia! Yes! I want this outfit though! This outfit has to be one of my favorite outfits in this series so far and I want it! I will cosplay this! Oh my god! I have to find a way to get some ventilation up in here because I will die! Literally I would die in this! But God, I want this outfit so bad. You know this one already, Dia Sa uh, Santa. Yeah, Dia and <laughs> Bruno. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and me, head of Team Child, are more like the one, <laughs> I'm like the one responsible to <laughs> uh, brought Santa. <laughs> I'm not the one more responsible. <laughs> oh, more like the one responsible, just like I... The leader or the one, um, the one, more like the one responsible over Team Zeno. That's me. One over Team Kitty. Yeah, Team Keys. Team Chata has more members, but please get along with us. That's right, let's get along. Hey, tell me more about up above. Um, tell me more about above. C close, you're close. Good, that's not really something you ask outside. Huh, why is that? Because there's a certain lot of people sneaking around. According to the pest from yesterday, the source of information about Ruto was an unknown man in a bar. He came close to us and suddenly handed the info over for free. They were instigated so they could find holes in the cleaners without any risk. They used underhanded methods. Then what kind of kaiju do you like? <laughs> what kind of kaiju do you like? Is there a sense of distance, Bob? This feeling may be, um, this feeling, maybe it's the vandals again. Might be. At any rate, I'm hearing that the vandals of today are especially vicious. Oh no, give it a rest! Uh, you get along well. Um, jeez, every single one of them. I'm just saying, be a bit more on edge. Why is that? Is someone after you all? Uh, I don't know. It's more like it's a thief or something. Thief? You mean vandals, maybe? Well, it's troublesome to have their eyes on you. Talking about vandals, I've heard um, uh, they've been looking for something pretty desperately. Hey, what? Well, hey, what was it? Dunno. Better watch out, bro. The head of the vandals has changed, so they will. Uh, whoa, what? So they uh, now will obtain the thing they're after, no matter the method. Seems uh, they've turned into a pretty vicious group. You gotta be more on edge, or you'll get robbed easily. Ah, that's right. I remember now. They're looking for things like this. The boots. Oh, free of charge. Oh no. For the information that. Uh, what? I'm the head of the vandals? Precious things have been laid to waste. That's the head of the vandals? What? What? That's the head of the vandals? Holy shit! So, dude, are we gonna have our Jerry Springer moment next chapter? Oh my god, that better be Bruno's dad, or I'm gonna be 
furious. Holy shit! Holy shit, that Fermi Rose dad! I'm gonna be pissed! Okay, by chapter 50, if that is that Rudo's daddy, I'm gonna be pissed! We need that reveal! We need that reveal! I want my Jerry Springer realness! I want my paternity test! Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below what you guys think, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I love Teen Child, by the way. Teen Child is everything! Um, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerd Sync. Love what we're doing. I want to help keep this operation alive and kick it so we can keep bringing you more Gachi Yakuda content. A few ways you could do that. Donate to our Cash App, PayPal, Patreon. Uh, just something off at of Amazon Wishlist, all that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerd I'll be seeing you later. Bye.